Israeli researchers have now secured $12 million to get their coronavirus vaccine into human trials by the summer. The scientists work for the company MIGVAX, an affiliate of the Miguel Galilee Research Institute, which in March successfully developed a vaccine for coronavirus affecting poultry. And Miguel has already been working for four years on another coronavirus strain that causes infectious bronchitis. But MIGVAX will now begin experimenting on rodents in as soon as May, with plans to start six-month human trials by the summer of 2020. Then, at the same time, an Israeli scientist from Tel Aviv University has now been awarded a U.S. patent on his vaccine design. It reportedly targets the virus's RBM, which enables the virus to bind to and infect a target cell. Meanwhile, elsewhere around the world, at least five other clinical human trials are already underway. And in Germany and in the UK, where trials have just begun, expectations are high. In the long run, the best way to defeat coronavirus is through a vaccine. After all, this is a new disease. This is uncertain science. But I'm certain that we will throw everything we've got at developing a vaccine. The UK is at the forefront of the global effort. We've put more money than any other country into the global search for a vaccine. And for all the efforts around the world, two of the leading vaccine developments are taking place here at home at Oxford and Imperial. Both of these promising projects are making rapid progress. And I've told the scientists leading them that we'll do everything in our power to support. Still, regardless of who's leading the race, health experts insist that the solution is months away or longer, and that a solution to the pandemic will not come from any one place, but rather it will be an international effort.